hello everybody and welcome back to my channel and i also would like to thank my new subscribers and friends who subscribed to my channel i would like you to know that i really appreciate it and i will do my best to create enjoyable content with you and so today i decided to create my two remaining spreads for november so i have been putting this off for quite a bit but today i finally find the time to work on my bullet journal so as you can see here i have already finished my 15th to 21st of november and I am kind of like working on a concept here. So I'd like to think that this is a vintage and modern uh, style or theme. So anyways, we are going to complete the first and last week of November. So let's get started. As you can see here, I have already done my header which says 22nd to 28th of november and then i would pencil in the layout that i would like to do for this week and then afterwards i will write over it with a pen i am using here a vintage pen in 0 0.5 i think this is a dope for the Sarasa vintage pen which quite quite nice as well but I think not as nice as the original Sarasa pens but for me it's good enough so here I am kind of writing over the pencil that I um, penciled in before to just kind of create a divider between the weeks or the days of the week. And then I use the stencil to write the first letter of the days of the week. Okay, so here we are in the last page or the last week of November. So that is the 29th to November to 5th of December so here I'm trying to draw the dividers for each day of the week and this time I decided to divide the last two days and the first week the first days of December by putting the last two days of November the upper portion of the page and then the first few days of December will be in the bottom portion of the page. Again, I am using the stencils to write the days of the weeks and also the dates. So yeah, so like I said, I find it really very useful to use a stencil so if you are kind of intimidated to start a bullet journal or journal just because you think that you are not artistic enough well like me <laughs> you can use stencils or stickers or washi tapes or paste some pictures or print something and paste it um, use the magazines or old books to embellish your journals or your bullet journals so finally we are done almost done with our pages as you can see here we have already the dates and the days of the week so we are about to start the most fun of bullet journaling which is to decorate the pages
you can see I wasn't lying when I told you that I would tend to go overboard with my stickers I love to kind of feel so pages with stickers and it makes me so happy so yeah so this is our page for uh, the last two weeks of November and I hope you enjoyed it and thank you guys for watching I hope you have a wonderful day and till the next video so bye